See, it cast a long ways behind the boat. Way back there, just like that. And once it hits the bottom, you can feel it when it hits the bottom. Don't let it sit there, but, you know, reel up your slack and then lift it up. One, two, three. All right? Let it hit the bottom. One, two, three. And, and, and let the line go completely slack. Let the line go completely slack on the fall. Because it's important to have that, that lure just flipping and fluttering all the way back down to the bottom. A lot of times the bite come on the fall. That's how you essentially use it. We got something. Went back down to the half ounce. You probably got a little brim or something. <laughs> yep. No, another little baby stripe. Look at there. I tell you. <laughs> The jig is bigger than he is, man. Because <laughs> people, I mean, that's bait. I mean, I can't fish with this as bait, this fish, because it's a game fish here in, in Alabama. But those of you who fish with golden shiners, you guys have golden shiners bigger than that fish. And you're fishing. There we go. Got him. No bait. No bait, just the jig by itself. Those of you who are wondering, do these jigs work by themselves? They work, baby. They work. Ah, ah. Ooh, is this some kind of parasite there or something? I don't know. All right, buddy. There you go. There you go. This is the half ounce jig with the little stripes on it. Red and gold. I've got a, a sale going until November 1st on these. Man, golly, I'm loving these jigs.